Hi everybody, Andrea here. Let's talk about a four day work week and why it really works for me and why I wish everybody would jump on the bandwagon and just do it. I do understand if you work for somebody else, it can be next to impossible to say, listen, I want to start working only four days a week. Give me a day off during the week, take it or leave it. You know, I totally understand that doesn't always work, but these are the benefits of a four day work week and how and why it's helped me so much. So basically life happens, right? If we work nine to five, then we come home, we have to make dinner, clean up after dinner, um, get things ready for the kids. If you have kids, you know, there's always stuff to do. By the time you finally sit down, is it eight o'clock? Is it nine o'clock? I don't know about you, but at that time I'm exhausted and I'm literally ready to go to bed. Did I do anything for myself? Not really, just working nine to five and then doing household stuff, but nothing truly relaxing, like maybe sitting outside, maybe reading a book. Maybe you just want to watch a Netflix movie. Maybe you want to take a course or two. Well, you just don't simply, you don't have time to do that. And it's very sad, but we spend most of our lives working. I forget the exact statistic, but we spend most of our life working and then we retire, let's say age 65, and then our health might not be the best that we can't really do the things that we want to do. So why a four day work week? Okay, really try this. This means you have a day off during the week to get things done, such as running errands, going to the grocery store, getting food for the week. Maybe you have to get your car cleaned. Maybe you want to go to the car wash. Maybe you want to spend that day just, just taking a course, reading a book, tr like truly taking a day off. And then you have the weekend. Some of us have to work on the weekends too, right? But at least you have that day that's time for yourself. Who here loves a long weekend friday saturday sunday or saturday sunday monday where you don't have to work please comment below would you prefer to take mondays off or fridays off if you had that choice i personally prefer a friday off because i feel from monday to thursday i can get all of my work done take a friday off and then i have the whole weekend now it doesn't really work for me though because i'm a mobile dental hygienist and a tutor educator so weekends are truly prime time for both of those things so i can't really take a full weekend off but what i can do is take wednesday thursday friday off and it's the best thing ever. Setting your own schedule to be able to do that really is a good thing. You will start to feel so much better and that you're able to get things done. What good is it if you work, say, Monday to Saturday? Sure, you're making money, but you're burnt out. You have no time to spend with your family. You're annoyed because you don't have time for yourself either. You're annoyed at other people. It's very easy to get angry or to snap at little things if you just feel like, oh my gosh, all I'm doing all day, all week, all month is working. Honestly, money isn't everything. And I say this to people all the time. If I had the choice to make a million dollars a year and work every day, I'd be like, no, I would prefer to make a lot less and have my four day work week. Because to me, I want to enjoy life while I can. I know that sounds kind of morbid. It sounds kind of silly. But I don't know what my health is going to be like in even 10 years. So live in the moment. And it's hard to live in the moment when you're working 9 to 5 every day doing stuff. Just simple stuff. Cooking dinner. Cleaning up from dinner. Cleaning up this. Cleaning up that. Taking the dogs for a walk. Or whatever. Bef before you know it, it's 9 o'clock and you're like... Hi guys, I've seen you all day, but I've just been picking up after everybody. Hello, how, how's everybody doing? Oh wait, it's time to go to bed now. What kind of a life is that? That doesn't sound a lot of, it doesn't sound like a lot of fun, right? But going back from before, if you're able to take a day off during the week, you can plan things accordingly. A lot of people like to meal prep, so they like to take one day and meal prep so dinners are faster, easier during the week. Well, if you had a day off, you can do that. You don't have to spend your weekend doing that. You can spend time with family or doing something that you want to do instead. So I really encourage you to try not to think about the money unless of course you truly can't afford it but try not to think about the money and really go to to working a four-day work week if you think you really can't afford it then i suggest finding other means to make more money because that will help too but look at your credit card statements 
Are you thinking you can't afford it because of your high spending habits? That's another video for another day. But if you're overspending, spending too much, spending more than you make, then of course you're going to feel like you have to work Monday to Saturday. But what if you cut back on your spending habits? What if you eat out every Friday night? What if you cut that back? Would you be able to afford to take a day off every single week? I bet you would. So think about that too. I hope you guys liked the video. Please comment below. I'm very curious to see what your thoughts are. And if you haven't yet, I am I am going to leave the link for you guys in the description down below. Join the Dental L Network community where it's a separate online form where you can get first dibs to these YouTube videos. They will be on the community first. Comment, reply, post anytime. Reach out to me a lot easier. There is now a live chat option through the community. So thank you guys as always for supporting me and my channel. I hope you liked this video. It's truly a passion of mine for people to work less. It really is, but still make the same amount of money so you can afford to work less, but ultimately to work less. So I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you guys and I'll see you guys in the next one.